What's up, everyone? This is Zelda Destroyer 229, and welcome back to Let's Play Tokyo Mirage Sessions Sharp FE. Last time, we did Tiki's second side quest. It was. Not gonna lie, kinda depressing. But. We've managed to get another new ability from Tiki that allows us to get potentially multiple performa from, well, sessions, I think. Something of the like. In this episode, we have once again returned to Shibuya. We still have plenty of side missions left, and by that I mean three. And today, since we're right here, you can obviously tell which one we're doing today. We're gonna be tackling Tsubasa's second side mission. So we're going to start the devilish comedy. Are all these just label as comedies? Opening your heart. All right. Let's go for it. Hopefully it's... Hopefully... I don't know what devilish means, but it's... Hopefully this doesn't turn to another romantic comedy. We've already had enough of those this intermission. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> そのことで悩みがあるんだ。アムリタガール。うん。アムリタシャワーの一番はやっぱりブドウかな。うーん、だけどアボカドも捨てがたい。うーん。で、悩みっていうのは？ああ、うん。それで撮影が始まったんだけど、監督から小悪魔力が足りないって言われちゃって。なんだそれ？ つまり、男心をくすぐるような仕草や色気が私にはないそうなのです。ねえ、いつきくん、どうすればそういうのって身につくと思う？それってズバリ思わせぶりってことなんじゃねえの？あ、トムくん。お疲れっす。時間空いた
ありがとうトーマくんそれじゃあ私早速デビルちゃんの情報を集めてみるスパーサー How the hell are you that innocent? <laughs> All right, well, whatever. We have an urgent topic from Subasa, so let's go ahead and read it. Subasa, you know how we talked about Little Devil? I have no idea where he is. He's somewhere in Shibuya, though. It'd be great if you could look for him too. I'm counting on you. And it's the general guy emoji with a fist raise and a determined look. Okay. So we need to find this cat. That's apparently somewhere in Shibuya. Hmm. Well, I mean, we could just very easily look around Shibuya and maybe just stumble across it. I have absolutely no idea where I would even, like, go for, like, hints or anything. Um... I mean, the only thing I can think of would be just going... Just checking everywhere. Oh, I can't even examine that. So... Yeah. It seems really weird that the only hint I have is it's somewhere in Shibuya. <laughs> Hmm, maybe I'm not supposed to really look towards other people. Maybe I am just supposed to look all throughout Shibuya and try to find this stupid cat. Seems kind of weird, though, that it doesn't really give me any direction. And everyone's just talking about Barry. All right, well, where exactly could this stupid cat be? I mean, I've already looked around like over half of Shibuya. There's really not many other places it could be. I don't know, maybe if I tried finding Tsubasa or something? Where else would a cat be? I mean, I'm kind of just poking my head through here thinking maybe there's like some sort of examine, like it's in like a back alley or something. Like maybe down th some invisible stairs. I don't know, I'm kind of grasping at straws here. Right, it could potentially be in the Hee Ho Mart, but that would be, I don't know, kind of weird. Well, I've searched Pretty much everywhere. There's only one place I haven't looked, and that's close to the station. Alright, this cat better be nearby. Ah! Oh! It's actually part of Subasa's side story. Maybe I was just supposed to go to each area. What she has to say. Itsuki, I think I found what might be the little devil. I, Subasa Oribe, will continue my pursuit. And it's a general guy emoji going, okay! Are we just supposed to screen transition enough times? Because if that's quite honestly it, then I really don't know what to say, because this is really not intuitive at all. Nanda. There are people who know where he is. Mm. Nearby alleyways, but definitely the Hee Ho Mart. Okay. Let's go ahead and just jump over there. Perhaps it's inside the Hee Ho Mart? Like, not the cat. That would be weird. But maybe like an NPC or something. No. <laughs> Only person here is Ellie, and I doubt she would know. Or either of the Annas. Again, I kind of doubt they would know. Maybe this person would know. <laughs> hmm. 
No. Okay. Maybe it is. Maybe it is the Annas. And then another message from Tsubasa. What does she have to say now? Itsuki, what do I do? Well, chasing after little devil, I found a delicious looking crepe place. And now it's a sad general guy emoji. Jeez, Tsubasa. Ondo. The alleys, huh? And it seems like Tsubasa keeps messaging me when I'm kind of close to whatever it is I'm supposed to be. Alright, let's see what she has to send us now. It's so good! <laughs> what the? She sent us a picture of the crepe! What is this, Instagram? But don't worry, I didn't forget about Little Devil. I bought this crepe to bait the kitty. I'll use it to successfully secure the target. And it's once again the determined guy, general guy look. Okay! <laughs> God dang it, Tsubasa! Okay, so they say it's somewhere around like the alleyways. Do they mean just around that area or. Or like just the alleyways in Shibuya? This is the most unintuitive quest! Okay. Huh. I also just got a message from Subasa, but yeah, let's go ahead and call her. All right, sending an urgent topic. This is the, I guess this, these are just from Subasa first before the urgent topic, cause these popped up right when I reached the alley. Itsuki. So the thing I was chasing, turns out it wasn't Little Devil. It was a raccoon, ORZ. And it took my crepe! <laughs> Leave just Tsubasa to have so much comic relief. Okay, now for the actual urgent topic. Or it could just be the sad guy emoji. Alright, now the urgent topic. Itsuki, how's it going on your end? Tsubasa, no good. And it's a general guy emoji with like a scribble next to him. Itsuki, I've gotten a tip on where Little Devil shows up. Tsubasa, that's amazing, Itsuki. What a detective. You're like the Watson of Shibuya. What about Sherlock? Itsuki, I'll be waiting for you in front of the drugstore. Also, Watson's the doctor. <laughs> Tsubasa no yatsu. 
猫と会話してるねえ何あれウケんだけどあいつ痛くね不思議ちゃん変わった私が大好きです的な<笑>写真撮ってネットにさらしちゃおっか何の騒ぎかと思って来てみたらすごい集中力ね周りの声や自然を一切気にしていないあキリアさん監督にたかだか一言言われたくらいで普通あそこまでやるバカみたいそんな言い方しなくても翼は真面目にやってるんですそう翼はやるのよバカみたいにがむしゃらに普通じゃない存在を目指しているから。だからあの子は強い化けるわよ翼は私も負けてられないわねものを理解するそして与えすぎないだけど放っておかないそれが小悪魔力なのですねバサオリベイソウズエンターテイナーはアチーブデニューアウェイクニング。セキンフォーム as a new performer、tantalizing charm。Also, how the hell did you figure that out on your own from talking to a cat? みたいだなうんやったよいつきくんエブリワンズエンエディエッツジーズダメイノーセンスウォッソウェヴァーアドアンソーエンオーティアルンチャーム she communicated to the cat by meowing to it And somehow learn the secret to devilish charm. Tsubasa, I worry about you sometimes. Alright, well, whatever. We've got ourselves a new radiant skill, Door of Allure. And of course, new topics in the side story from Tiki. I sense a new performer was born from Tsubasa, even from here. I can perform a unity for her, so come to the Bloom Palace whenever you're ready. And it's the OK Tiki emoji. Alright, l well, this, this quest went from not really straightforward to just straight up weird. Also, why the hell would Kyria need to step up her game? Just in terms of the diligence department? Because that was really the only compliment that she gave Tsubasa for that. Otherwise, it seemed like. Tsubasa, you're crazy. Stop being crazy. Oh my gosh, Tsubasa is a crazy cat lady now. <laughs> okay, enough ragging on Tsubasa. You can make Door of Allure. Though, what exactly that will do, I am not 100% sure, but we'll find out. Let's see. Endless song, Door of Allure. I know just how to tease your heart. 
it's weird because she actually did learn exactly what she needed to learn from this. Which... All's well that ends well? I guess? Let's hope talking to that cat didn't ruin her reputation. ね、こう観察するなんて素晴らしい、自由な考え方ね。これが正解なのかはわからないけど、でも私なりに掴んだ答えで、ぶつかってみるよ。その息を翼。それにしても難しいものなのね。どうすれば男の人の心を動かせる
I'm not sure if that was actually a good response at the end, but whatever. Like I said, all's well that ends well. And, coincidentally enough, Subas is the one that gains the level. Is it a good one? Uh, pretty decent. I wish it, that too wasn't in strength though, but what are you gonna do? Subasa has grown as an entertainer and has become an Amrita girl. And let's see. Ooh, she got an ad lib performance. Subasa's kiss? Okay. So what exactly triggers that? Do 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 do. It's an artist. Let's see. Do 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 do. Subasa's kiss. It's a land skill. Oh! Damn it! Oh, but that that's actually a pretty good effect. Attacks all foes and delays enemy turns. Ugh, great. Now I kind of need to have her have a lance skill. But what would I get rid of? Oh, this just got so much more problematic for Subasa. Because I elected to forsake lance skills with her. But if she gets an ad lib for lances, why couldn't it have been wind or force? Whatever, they're the same thing in this game. I'd probably get rid of, rid of either Media or Dia. I'm just not sure which one. Hmm, actually, now that I think about it, depending on what skills Mamari gets. I might be able to get away with this. Because if Mamari also learns healing skills, I could have, say, Mamari focus on group healing and Tsubasa focus on single healing. So they would serve different purposes. I mean, that's just one way of going about this, but I kind of want to have some way of triggering that ad lib skill. Alright, but whatever. She at least still has the possibility to get Assault Dive. Has she had that possibility before? Yeah, so I kind of ruined that. Oh well, whatever. That's why you, the skills pop up at different times. Alright, well, with that taken care of, that will do it for this episode. But let's check in with Kata, see if she has anything to say. She's definitely an odd one, that's for sure. But, like I mentioned, that'll do it for us here. So, next time on Let's Play Tokyo Mirage Sessions, Sharp FE. We've had quite the array of side missions this time around, but there's still more to do. We still have Kyria, and we still have Barry. So next time, we're going to be tackling one of their side missions. So until then, everyone, take care. <laughs>